meteorologist Dave Warren joins us, and the rain meters must be overflowing. They're, they're, they're pretty high right around Miami, downtown Miami. They'll be, we'll be able to take a rest tomorrow. In fact, the next few hours, it's pretty much done. But right now here, unfortunately, that rain's still coming down. Uh, it is on its way out, but one place will still get some heavier rain right here uh, in Doral. It's just west of the airport. Uh, the rain off in the distance is moving east. Uh, temperatures into the lower 70s. Enjoy these now because once the rain clears out, these will drop down into the 50s here overnight tonight. Now, the end of the rain's pretty much right here. This is the last hour. It's racing off to the east here. Still this area of heavy rain crossing right over the Dolphin Expressway and where the Turnpike meet here. And that'll just move near downtown Miami, Aventura, just south of that. Close-up view shows the heaviest rain right now, right about to move into Doral and continue east across 95. Back edge moving into uh, inland Miami-Dade County and Broward County. There's still a little bit of rain around Pompano Beach and Deerfield Beach. That's continuing to move off to the east. Rain here just about another hour. Then we'll clear. Key West is uh, trying to clear up. The clouds still around. That is our picture this evening, though, uh, from Mallory Square. Temperatures into the upper 70s. They will drop into the 50s tonight and barely make it above 70 tomorrow. It's right about where we are now. It's dropping into the upper 60s there, just to the north. Showers now, then a cooler breeze. That wind picks up out of the northwest 10 to 15, maybe a higher gust at times, and uh, we'll be into the 50s there by tomorrow morning. It's all with this. It's a cold front which is moving south. This is where it is right now. A lot of moisture over the air the last few days, but that is about to change. We'll go ahead till Sunday afternoon here and look at the dry air moving in. This will be followed by an area of high pressure, so a bit of a breeze there tomorrow, but then a little calmer by tomorrow night. Breezy sun Sunday with no more rain. In fact, we stay dry pretty much until about Wednesday and Thursday. This is the next storm coming in. It'll bring a cold front next weekend. Showers will increase there out ahead of that. Uh, the temperatures, though, that's the thing we want to watch. From the 70s, we're dropping into the 50s tonight. There are the 40s, barely above 70 tomorrow. This is by about 3, 4 o'clock, and then we quickly drop into the 50s while the game's going on tomorrow night. 40s get a little closer, so inland areas with that light breeze might see temperatures trying to drop into the upper 40s. That's about as cool as we get there for Monday. So warmest right now, then we drop into the 50s. Kickoff is right about here. We could see temperatures dropping into the 50s there early tomorrow evening, and then we start to climb back above the average there on Tuesday. Bright sunshine at least, gust to 25 miles an hour. 71 will be our temperature. There's a small craft advisory because of that breeze. North to northwest, 10 to 20 knots, 3 to 5 foot seas, moderate chop in the bays. Extended forecast. The chill is here both Sunday, Monday morning. Tuesday is a little warmer. Clouds come back Wednesday. We're very warm on Thursday at 84 with a few showers. Then that cooler breeze comes in Friday and Saturday with the next cold front.